this is an auroral substorm event. So we can see here all this aurora. This is all coming out from uh, the magnetosphere. And we get these breakdowns in the properties within the magnetosphere that we call substorms. And that causes these, uh, these bright spots and this massive expansion of the aurora in here, this massive brightening. So that's what we call an auroral substorm. And that has been one of the, the key goals of, uh, of Cluster, is to investigate what's going on with these uh, in much more detail than has previously been possible. Yeah. The aurora here forms a, a ring around the magnetic pole. And the important thing about this is that all of this region, the magnetic field coming out of here, is always linked to the, uh, the Earth. So there is a, uh, a magnetic field line that comes out and round and comes back in somewhere down the bottom. Whereas this region inside the auroral oval, so uh, this auroral oval actually extends all the way onto the, to the day side. And uh, you can't see it here because of the, uh, the protected sunlight. But this, this oval, the, the region within that, all that magnetic field comes out and it's only connected to the Earth at one end. So this is actually connected to the sun and the solar wind. And the changes in this are driven by substorms and other processes within the magnetosphere.